Once upon a time in ancient Persia, there lived a Sasanian prince named Khosro. One night, Khosro's grandfather appeared in his dream, and talked about the future of the kingdom, and his wife-to-be named Shireen. Shortly after, a close friend described a beautiful Armenian princess named Shireen to Khosro, and he immediately had an epiphany. Khosro left for Armenia in search of his future wife, but little did he know of what was taking place where he was headed. Shireen, the Armenian princess, fell madly in love with Khosro after seeing his painting, and embarked on her own journey to Khosro's capital, Mardin, to search for him. As fate would have it, in the middle of his travels, Khosro happened upon Shireen, who was bathing in a stream, a moment that has been immortalized in many paintings and textiles. However, as Khosro had never really seen Shireen before, he failed to recognize her, and carried on with his journey. When Khosro finally reached Armenia, he learnt of Shireen's travel to Mardarin. Unaware of what destiny had in store for him, he sent a delegate to bring Shireen back to Armenia, but soon after, the death of his own father, the king of Persia, warranted his return to Mardarin. Once again, the two lovers began travelling in the opposite direction, as if mere actors in a cruel stage set by fate. Back in Mardarin, General Baram Chobin overthrew Khosro, and he fled to Armenia in an attempt to seek refuge. In Armenia, the two lovers finally met each other, but Shireen besought Khosro to win his throne back from the usurper if he wished to have her hand at marriage. Khosro, knowing that he cannot win against Baram without help, entreated Caesar, the Emperor of Rome, to help him in his plight. Caesar agreed to help Khosro, but only if he accepted to marry his sister. Left with no choice, Khosro bowed down before his fate, and agreed to take Caesar's sister to wife despite his feelings for Shireen. Finally, Khosro regained his throne with the help of Romans, but not once did he stop thinking about Shireen, the reason why he sought Caesar's help in the first place. While fate is mostly cruel, sometimes, it works in miraculous ways, and as luck would have, Khosro's wife passed away, and took with her Khosro's political obligations. A free man, Khosro re-embarked on his journey to win Shireen's heart, and after a series of heroic deeds, his grandfather's prophecy came true, and Shireen became Khosro's wife, and the Queen of Persia. However, when fate grants a boon, it also takes something more precious as payment. In an unexpected turn of events, Khosro's son from his previous marriage fell in love with Shireen. Driven crazy by his feelings, he murdered his father, and ordered his stepmother to marry him. Shireen did not wish to marry her kin, and the agony of her beloved husband's murder weighed heavily on her shoulders. To free herself of this burden, she committed suicide. As a symbolic demonstration of their love, the lamented wife and husband were buried in one grave, and their souls became one in the afterlife. <laughs>